So we're gonna stand right here. Okay. All right, you ready? Whenever you're ready. Is that music too loud or you, you can work with it? I'll work with it. Okay. All right. Good morning and welcome to another episode of Homegrown's 411 episode and we are on to donuts now so we are here in Dunkin Donuts off of 84th and O and I'm here today with Miranda Meese from our team welcome thanks for joining me today of course wouldn't miss out on donuts I know right <laughs> I'm Jenny Meyer and we're on the Lincoln Select Real Estate Group at Nebraska Realty so uh, one of the perks of this job is tasting delicious food around town so we're gonna dig in um, we've got three rules for our donut tasting that we're doing right now. Do you know what the rules are by chance? I do. The first one is they can't know we're coming. Um, you can only have one bite and it has to be a chocolate raised donut. <laughs> Good right. job. Yep. Okay. Yep. Those are the three rules. So I've got my sack of donuts here. So I will dig in. All right. One for you. Oh gosh. Sorry. That's the receipt. <laughs> All right. Okay, so I'm gonna get rid of the sack. Okay, and here we go. Close up, close up. Nice. So my first thought at looking at the donut is it is a really good um, uh, thickness. I would say. I think so. Yeah. It's a pretty typical raised donut. Yeah. I've had some that were super thin before. So this has a good thickness to it. Um, the frosting is drizzled so pretty. I do have to note that. <laughs> it is. It looks delicious. Yeah. It's got an appropriate amount of frosting um, proportionate to the donut. So I'm excited to try this one. All right, ready? You ready? All right. Cheers. Cheers. Hmm, that's really good. Very, very good. Yeah. Sorry, my mouth is full. <laughs> We're going to take the first bite and then there's like silence for about 20 seconds while you get your food down. That's super yummy though. It's um, very good. The cake, the dough is a little on the dry side, I would say. I, yeah, I think it's I average. Know. It wasn't too bad. Yeah. Donuts a little bit for me. It's a little bit on the dry side, but, but it has the, a good the flavor. flavor. Is amazing, yeah. Yeah, I agree. What do you think of the frosting? Um, actually, it's one of the better chocolate ones I think I've mm -hmm. experienced. But yeah, I tend to favor kind of the sweeter chocolate frosting on donuts, and so I think this has like the right amount of sweetness to it. Definitely. So, um, I'm sorry. I have to take another bite. <laughs> I think you can only take one. I know. <laughs> We've been breaking the rules lately. <laughs> it's so okay. hard with well, one I'm bite. I'm gonna try one more too. I just wanna double take too. Plus it's good. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, this is super delicious. Very, very good. All right, any last comments before we give the rating? No, I think I'm ready. Okay. So, on a scale of one to 10, what is your rating on this donut? Um, I think I would go can I have two? I put it somewhere in between like seven and a half and eight. I would actually have to agree with that. Um, how about a 7.8? Perfect. Okay. Our official rating is 7.8. And once again, we're at Dunkin' Donuts on 84th and O. Um, it's super cute in here, by the way, as yes, well. Yes, it is. <laughs> um, so that's a wrap. Uh, thank you for joining us for another episode of Homegrown's Food 411. Um, the uh, series of chocolate donuts. As always, don't forget to follow our homegrown page on Facebook and Instagram. We have lots of fun contests, um, food tastings, uh, restaurant videos, tons of fun stuff around town. So thanks, and we'll see you next time. Bye.